boy Chili from Lady Law's Morning Show, 101.5 Jams, 101.5Jams.com with the one and only Adrian Wilson. I'm gonna run you through a couple things because you know we're curious. You know, I have a bunch of people hit me up on Twitter and uh, Facebook and stuff. Now, you had a couple, you have a bunch of big moments here in Arizona. Uh, number one, obviously, you got drafted in 2001. Mm -hmm. Came from North Carolina, out of North Carolina State. What was that like? What was the transition like? Uh, it was eye opening, to say the least. I didn't know Arizona existed. So I actually got drafted. Oh, man. So, uh, you know, when I came away, it was, it was very hot, but uh, I, I, I kind of got used to it right away. And, uh, you know, I've been here for 12 years, and I've made this home for 12 years, so it was great. So you obviously fell in love with the place? Oh, most definitely. Most okay, definitely. obviously you're kind of a YouTube sensation. I don't know if everybody knows, but <laughs> I saw this YouTube clip of you jumping over a hurdle that was, what, 66 inches tall? Yeah. That's like about here. <laughs> Do that? Uh, <laughs> not quite 66. I mean, that was that was a few years ago. That was a few years ago. I'm probably 60 now. 60 cool. is still good though. No, absolutely. That's, okay. That's like a year. <laughs> okay. But what, what possessed you to even try to do something like that? Like, cause it looked like you're holding a locker room. Yeah, competition. You know how guys get to talk and jump. Somebody said, "Yo, I'm gonna jump 50." Yo, Yo you can't. Jump. You can't do this. You can't jump over that. No, really, I can't. And. Next thing you know, it's on YouTube. There's a YouTube video I didn't video even out know it was being taped, so. Eight, it's got like over eight million views. I actually checked it last night just to make sure. So you're obviously very much into fashion. Uh, let's talk about that a little bit, High Point. Uh, high Point's my baby. That, you know, that's something that uh, I've, I've wanted to start for a long time when I got the opportunity to do it. How long time, like how long, like back in college or right when you got into the league? Like, um, probably, was, probably right when I got into the league. Because a lot of athletes, they get a lot of opportunities to do a lot of outside ventures. What makes you go to the clothing store instead of you know, all the entertainment stuff or whatever else? I love fashion. And uh, it's probably, it was probably one of the things that was kind of like near, more more near to me than, you know, than with the entertainment stuff. I can, I, I can do less. I, I can care less about that. So, more about getting people. So fresh. So <laughs> growing, growing up, were you into shoes? Are you into all these retro Jordans? I'm, I'm, I'm into a lot. That's you know that's that's the thing that I love. I do love shoes. Um, I own a shoe store, so people right. always say, "Hey, let me go see your closet." I'm like, dude, I own a shoe store. Oh <laughs> you know, man, okay. Not, you know, let's not talk about the closet. Let's go to the store, and I'll show you all my shoes. Okay. Okay. I'll this morning a little bit about you know bringing the Cardinals to the Super Bowl. A lot of people thought it would never be done, but you took them there. Like, what was that experience like, and what was it like doing something like that for all these fans? And once in a lifetime experience, uh, you know, playing the NFC Championship game, just having it here at home. You know, I think we got the lucky draw that year. You know, we, we were the higher seed, so we were able to play at home. And uh, to win that game, and then to go to Tampa, and just have that whole experience of the whole week. And, uh, you know, just, just to, to see what the Super Bowl is about, I think, you know, most people wouldn't understand it because of what they see on TV, but just the whole experience of it all, and to see the fans and everybody thousand dollars at Phoenix Children's Hospital like you're able you've been able to do so much for Arizona already you just decided hey I want to get involved with Phoenix Children's Hospital what makes an athlete decide to do all that um, I think it comes from the heart something that that you just you know have to pick and choose from you know your people bring okay you have to choose between this one this one and this one no it doesn't work like that um, it's, it's more about what you feel in your heart and and, and what's the right thing to do I think that was the right thing to do at this time for me. Okay, and you got the uh, you got the Xbox tournament. So, yeah. are you a video gamer? I am. I'll, I'll probably win it tomorrow, to be honest with you. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? Okay. Okay. Yeah, I'll probably. I'll What's probably the gamer tag? Where can people find you at? Uh, my gamer tag is High Point Twenty Four. High Point Twenty Four. Boy, Adrian Wilson, Chili the Hustle. You already know Lady Laws Morning Show. One One Five Jams. One One Five Jams. Dot com. Hey, I'm gonna go get some shoes from this guy after I beat him in some. <laughs> Y'all already know.